Hello, my name is Jamie True. I'm Head of Business Development here at Simbled. And if you're watching this video, then you're interested in one of our smart cylinders. Here I have a list of frequently asked questions that we get emailed in every day regarding our cylinders. And I just wanted to go through some of them to hopefully answer any questions or queries you might have. So let's jump into it. How do I know the correct size for my door? So we sell uh, two sizes for our smart cylinders and that is a four centimeters to 8.5 centimeters and then an eight centimeters to 11 centimeters. So all you have to do is measure the width of your door and you will find the one that's right for you. So if it comes out at seven centimeters, you would go for the four to 8.5. If it comes out at nine centimeters, you would go for the eight to 11. Hopefully that makes sense. Um, it is worth noting that some doors uh, do have a rosette. So if you want to keep that, you will need to factor in that when measuring the width of your door as well, okay? What are the pros of using a smart cylinder? Some really, really good ones actually. Um, one is ease of installation. So these take minutes to install. Uh, they require no drilling, they require no, ha no, no real handiwork, no tools really, other than just a simple screwdriver and the tools that are provided with our cylinders. Uh, all you have to do is remove the Euro cylinder that is currently in your door and replace it with our cylinder, which takes, like I said, minutes and doesn't require much work. The benefit of this as well is that it becomes very tenant friendly. So if you're renting your property and you want to turn your door into a smart door, but don't want to do any alterations to the door that the landlord might not be overly happy about that, our cylinders are an amazing solution for that because you can just take out the Euro cylinder, keep that somewhere safe, replace it with our cylinder here. Um, and then when time comes for you to move on, you can then just take that back out and replace it with the Euro cylinder and there will be absolutely nothing different about the door than when you moved in. Can this lock be fitted to a wooden door? So as long as the door comes with a Euro, cylinders, uh, a Euro cylinder to replace with our smart cylinder, yes. Uh, the, the cylinders are really, really compatible with pretty much all types of door as long as it has that Euro cylinder. Doesn't matter the material the door's made of, um, and our, our thickness range should pretty much cover uh, any thickness of door that, that's standardised uh, that might be in, in the UK. If I smash the lock with a hammer from the outside, then will I get access to the shaft that turns the cylinder and can use pliers to open the latch? So simple. So there's no lock or door in the world that couldn't be destroyed with enough time, effort, tools and will to do so. However, our engineers have meticulously designed a very complicated mechanism and a robust body which makes this not a very simple job for anybody. It's not as simple as just, you know, whacking off the, the end of the cylinder and, and then just twisting the, the spindle. It is not that simple. Um, so by doing so, by, by the way we've designed it, uh, it should give you a high level of security and safety and hopefully that peace of mind you need. Would the cylinder work on a three-point lock door, the ones you have to lift the door handle? So again, if your lock has a Euro cylinder um, and a multi-point uh, hook where you lift the handle, yes, because by changing the cylinder over, you're not affecting um, any of the features that the door had before. So as long as your handle uh, that, that you'll be keeping on there lifts and locks, that will still, that will still remain. What happens when the batteries are low or flat? Uh, so the batteries should never really run out uh, because it will remind you in the app and you can check the status at any time. However, I do know that sometimes things happen, perhaps you've gone on a business trip uh, and you've come back and the, the locks died because you forgot to change it before you went or something. It's not a problem because our locks come with multiple fail safes to get in and change the batteries. We have a, an emergency mechanical key that will be provided with your lock, uh, but then you also have a slot for a power bank to be plugged into the lock, which will give it just enough juice to open up, get you through the door for you to be able to change those batteries. What kind of doors are suitable for a simple cylinder? Um, so again, sort of uh, what, what we were saying earlier, that 
pretty much any door with a Euro cylinder, uh, you can retrofit one of our um, cylinders. It is very, very uh, easy to do so, and a lot of doors uh, would would be capable to hold one of our cylinders. Um, if you're not sure though, because of course perhaps you've got a, a really unique design on your door or a new door or something that you're a little bit concerned about, don't worry, you can go through to our WhatsApp uh, or our support email, and they are expert compatibility checkers. Uh, and you'll be able to send videos and pictures of your current mechanism and door, and they will be able to let you know uh, whether A, it's compatible, and B, if not, what solutions we could offer you. Are any electrical connections necessary to install an electronic cylinder? And what happens to my smart lock during an electrical blackout? No electrical connections are needed. These are completely ba battery operated. And as such, if there is a local blackout, um, you do not have to worry. Your lock will still be functioning as is, as is intended, uh, as long as the batteries are um, alive, of course. Um, so, yep, not a problem. How long is the battery life? This depends on many factors like battery quality, usage, etc. But for the average user, we found around a year before they need to change the batteries again. My cylinder is currently very close to the edge of the door. Can I install this smart cylinder on that? So from the outside, when the door is closed, you need to measure and ensure that you have at least 2.5 centimeters between the center of your current cylinder and the door frame. Not the door, the door frame. Um, this will ensure that the outer knob will not hit the door frame um, when using one of our cylinders. Again, if you're not sure, go through to our compatibility checkers and they will be able to provide you with a, um, a more comprehensive answer. Do I need a gateway and can I use this for my Airbnb flat slash hotel? So in terms of gateway, uh, if you're looking to manage this completely remotely, so for most Airbnb slash hotels, they will want to do so. Yes, you will want to use a gateway. Um, what this means is that you will be able to generate new codes, remove users, check the logs from wherever you are. So if you've got somebody booking in on Airbnb, it doesn't require you to go to the lock um, and uh, create a new uh, temporary passcode for this uh, customer and send it on to them. You can just do that from the comfort of your own home or wherever you are. If you're just using this for domestic use and you're not interested in managing it remotely, then no, you don't need a Wi-Fi bridge. Our locks work completely independently within Bluetooth range. Again, with the Airbnb flat and hotel, um, yes, this is a perfect solution because it not only allows um, self check-ins, it allows you to manage new users and remove users uh, completely remotely, but it also means no more um, losing of keys, which obviously for an Airbnb owner means they tend to have to change the entire lock because you don't know if someone's disappeared with that key and is going to come back at a later date, let themselves in uh, and do unsavory things to your property. That is no longer a worry with simple smart locks. And finally, uh, does this does this integrate with uh, home assistants like Alexa and Google Home? Yes, if you have a Wi-Fi bridge, you can link these to your Alexa and Google Home. Thank you very much. Hopefully this has uh, answered any particular questions you might have. But of course, if you have any further questions, do not hesitate to reach out to us on WhatsApp, email, or give me a call. Thank you so much.